Some YouTube channels are exploding right from the very first video they upload. And some channels still don't have enough views after 200 uploads. So what's the real reason for this happening? And how can you turn your channel into a money-making machine? This is eMaster. Show me your friends, and I will show you your future. Well, this doesn't mean you'll be unsuccessful if you're hanging out or chatting with the wrong people, because you can learn a lot from their mistakes. We've seen many huge and small channels across our friends and community, and the conclusion we came to analyzing all the channels we will put in this video. So stay tuned, listen carefully, and watch your channel grow with these simple YouTube algorithm tricks. You have to have good content. Okay, skip this as we all know this. Honestly, there are only three factors that are so incredibly important when it comes to a successful YouTube channel. Video retention, click-through rate and engagement, and relevance. Having good content doesn't always mean you'll be getting millions of views. That's why your video retention must be high. If the YouTube average quality content retention is 35%, you should aim for 40 or more. This indicator shows that the viewers are interested in your video and you can hold them on the YouTube platform for as long as possible. Moreover, the longer they watch the video, the more ads can be displayed which is good for both YouTube and you. If you're an expert in some kind of niche or know things that really might help people, it also doesn't mean that the audience will watch your videos because they may think that you are not going to answer their questions or your video is not engaging enough. When it comes to the engagement rate, you should deliver your message in a way that people don't have questions about it and make an additional value to the viewer. Believe me or not, if you make an amazing video on YouTube, your audience will comment and like and share without even being asked. That's what YouTube wants from creators. They want you to build good content so the viewers will engage, like, subscribe and comment. Before you receive your engagement, make sure your thumbnail is clear and people will click on it. But I will explain why the thumbnail is so important a bit later, when we discuss the relevance of your content. So you have decent information and have already made an engaging video, and would like to get this video to as many viewers as possible. Why is the thumbnail so important? You see, YouTube is like Instagram Reels or TikTok. At first, when the video is uploaded to YouTube, you get the very first place in the search bar results, and your video is boosted so people can see it. If your thumbnail is not good enough, it won't catch any attention. Your impressions will drop suddenly. Then it will be shown to less and less people, unless your video is going to have good retention. If this happens, then your impressions are slowly building back, and you are going to get more and more impressions every single day. At this point, having a bad thumbnail with a click rate of 3 to 5% is the worst case, because if YouTube decides to test your video to the broader audience, it may result in less views. The good click-through rate for your thumbnail should be around 10% or more. It depends on the niche you are. There are some niches that just can't get millions of views because there's not enough audience for that particular niche. Overall, having a low click-through rate will result in the impression dips. This way YouTube understands that your video is not good enough to be featured in the homepage for a broader audience. So making great content, having decent thumbnails, and answering people's questions with a great script and editing effects is the answer to your success on YouTube. But if you are creating content over and over again on the same topic and your retention is lower than we suggest and your click-through rate is low too, you might get viral anyway. And here's why. YouTube is not only relevant content, but also about the activity. If your channel keeps posting content regularly and it's not taking off, but collecting only a few views, it's because YouTube doesn't know your audience yet. Or, of course, you are making poor content that barely anyone would want to watch. So don't lie to yourself and take a look at your videos. There's plenty of channels on YouTube just uploading content, thinking one day they will suddenly take off and become famous with millions of views. This is not going to happen. Medium quality to high quality videos will do the work and on average it takes about 98 videos before YouTube starts generating some real views and making money. If you have many videos and it's been years on YouTube, you should notice multiple things on YouTube and optimizing your existing or new channels the way you want it. It only requires a bit of information analysis. Here's a question I get asked frequently. Can you cheat the YouTube algorithm? Yes, you can. But is it worth it? 
I'm sure you've seen lots of YouTube channels that are growing super fast, and you just can't figure out the reason why. They often use non-original content or poorly made content that literally no one would watch, but still generating millions of views. This is because they're buying views and engagement. But keep in mind that your audience that viewed your content is grouped and your videos are displayed to very similar people based on their interests. This means that buying views and engagement won't help you out in a very specific niche because your purchased views are not interested in your video, so the next viewers won't be too, causing your attention to drop. When this happens, your video may become invisible in search because people didn't like it. Another reason why buying views is just not right. YouTube may notice it and your channel may be terminated. This is because the audience and the views you purchase will never buy anything from the ads shown on your video. And this will trigger the YouTube algorithm to detect fake views. So if you're planning on doing it, think twice because it's just not worth it. The best growth option for YouTube is a natural growth. By saying that, you have to understand that the viewers that recently watched your videos are very similar to people to whom YouTube is going to show your content. Posting your YouTube IRL outside YouTube into random and not specific groups may cause you bad results. This is very important so we always advise new members not to promote their videos outside YouTube and let the YouTube algorithm instead pick the right audience for this particular video. It's more than just good content. Did you know that even poor quality content gets recommended by the YouTube algorithm in the homepage to millions of people? Did you know why? This is because the videos answer the audience's questions and they might have a clickbaity thumbnail along with the title. Even if you had a perfect video, deeply explained the topic and provided valuable information, you might not get recommended. This is why title and thumbnails play a huge role when it comes to the YouTube homepage and browsing featured views. If you want to see an example of good and bad thumbnails, like this video and leave a comment down below so we can create a video all about it. Keep in mind, having a great thumbnail and title makes you visible, even if you feel you have poor content. Let's say you have a 10% click-through rate and a thousand daily views on a video. If you could increase that click-through rate to 20%, you'd have 2,000 daily views, right? Actually, it's wrong. If you managed to increase the click-through rate twice, your views would increase tenfold or even more. This will happen because you will improve your click-through rate and also exceed the average click-through rate on YouTube, which will bring you even more impressions. Keep things simple. Focus on quality, thumbnails, and titles, and we are sure your YouTube success will come. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, and make sure you watch our other videos about YouTube.